When you get asked, what do you prefer? Online shopping or shopping in retail stores? What would you say? Obviously, the advantages of online shopping are tremendous. It's fast, easy and convenient. You don't have to drive somewhere, don't have to queue or change in warm dressing rooms. And you have a way bigger assortment online. You can search by categories and the prices are often more competitive than in retail stores. In consequence, more and more customers are shifting from in-store shopping to online shopping. In 2019, global e-commerce sales reached 3.5 trillion US dollars. This corresponds to 14.1% um, of total retail sales. In 2015, this share was only about the half of that. And until 2023, it is prospected to reach more than 20%. In the last 10 years, many physical retailers had to suffer under the upcoming of e-commerce, um, facing store closures or even bankruptcy. This is often referred to as the retail apocalypse. So I'm trying to get behind the question, is, re is physical retail coming to an end in the foreseeable future? Definitely the share of e-commerce will increase further and retailers will have a hard time competing with them. But retail stores, as you can imagine, have their advantages as well. You're able to immediately feel the garment's fabric, the quality, you can see the real color and you can see directly how it fits you. So you won't buy as much stuff which you have to return in the end. But basically the trend to online shopping is just happening. I think the idea is not to displace retailing at all, but to combine online shopping with all its conveniences and efficiency with the experience of retailing. Best example is Amazon. Obviously, they started as a full online platform, but now they are building and diversifying in physical retailing. Another good example is Toys R Us. They come from the other side with over 1,500 stores worldwide, but they couldn't stay competitive anymore with all the online stores. Um, so they got bankrupt and had to close all the stores. But then they were starting all over again with a completely new business model. Um, they operate an online store now, but they also support it with big retail stores, which especially provide a lot of entertainment and experiences for children, like this Ferris wheel here in one of the stores. Of course, they also sell their products here, but the focus definitely relies on the entertainment and experiences. So on the one hand, neither the mere online shopping nor the complete retail experience is the most attractive thing. Um, you can also see that it depends on the product. So for media products, for example, people prefer to buy online, definitely. But for clothes, which I didn't expect, it's about 50-50. And for furniture, in difference to that, people absolutely prefer to buy it in a store. But to summarize it again, as forecasts predict, the trend is going to e-commerce and that would definitely happen, but the stores will still have to rely on retail stores for the experience of touching and seeing something before you buy it.